that? Nah, it was actually closed. I had some Saturday deals lined up for you people. I thought Saturday here was gonna be open. Keep in touch. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What's up, y'all? Brian early. Or Brian late. Early. <laughs> is, is it late or, or is yeah. it early? I ain't go to sleep, so I think it's late. You didn't end up sleeping? I ain't go to sleep at all. I was on 2K. Look at the advancement in life. <laughs> this is gonna be us for the next 14 hours, bro. Yeah. Yeah. All right, y'all. September 16th, it is currently 4.06 a.m. The Holy Ground team, we got John, we got Christian. Ready to take on the day at SneakerCon. To me, biggest event of the year. Looking forward to it. Got a bunch of heat. Come through Holy Ground. Hopefully we get a good spot. Hopefully whoever's there, say what's up. SneakerCon's always been my favorite. So hopefully we get a lot of foot traffic and hopefully we're able to sell a lot of the heat today. Maybe someone will buy the whole table. Who knows? You'll see us over there next clip. See ya. We're here. It's currently 5.17 in the morning. Finally made it. You can't see right now, but we're walking to a line. I don't know how long they've been here. It's kind of cold. I kind of regret not bringing a sweater or something. I regret not bringing any slides. We're about to fall in line, wait like two hours or something like that, and get our spot. Hey, what's going on everyone? Thanks for watching the video. We're doing this to do a giveaway. So we just wanna give back to you guys uh, for just your faithful support. So we're gonna go ahead and give away a Yeezy Foam Runner in the carbon colorway. It's a easy flip, easy wear, whatever you guys wanna do, your size, whatever size you want. And you gotta do three things. You gotta like this video, subscribe, and comment down just literally anything you liked about the video. We love reading the comments, but with all that being said, let's go back to the action. Bro, this place is huge. No, I'm for sure making laps right here. Almost looks similar to Hobbit's Hall. Happened to get this all done in like 10 minutes. So now we have like the rest of the six hours before it opens. We got John coming back from Chick-fil-A. We got Matt on his way. Yeah, just stay tuned, man. I don't know what else there's. There's John. Right on cue. Yeah, wherever it takes us, it takes us. Hey, you guys set up nice. <laughs> I'm going to take a break for a bit. We got everything set up. I'm going to take a little two hour nap. If I'm not back by 10, y'all gotta call me. Good luck, hope everything sells. If I come back and nothing's sold, you're fired. <laughs> Made it back. We're looking for three pairs right now. We're looking for some reverse mocha, size 11, some olive, size 11, and some fragment high, size 11. For the most part, pretty easy pairs that we come across. Whoever got the best price, you're gonna take my money. Is there any way you could go like this highest bid last sale? It's like at eight. 14. I couldn't go. That lap, but if you look at like the previous like five to six sales before that, they're over a thousand dollars. It's those two people that just the whole market on it. Like look at the next ask on it, 280. Yeah. These are all kind of all over the place. Um, it's a good shoe, so I don't mind people paying for the over market. Try to hit them with the offer now. Do I just probably double back around? That's not really bad though. I don't know how much John is willing to pay, but he needs those reverse smokers. Damn, this place is huge. He got a good collection. Size 12. Uh, I don't want to touch them. All of the under release. We have a couple of people in shop trying to sell it to us. We really don't know what the market is until they fully, fully drop. It's kind of crazy how a lot of people get in these unreleased pairs nowadays. But I mean, when you start seeing a lot of people having like unreleased pairs, you see them kind of floating around the market. Keep in mind that they're probably going to drop a lot. Uh, I don't, I think they're fire still. So I don't know how good they are, but like right now they're hovering around like 350. Some people are still slinging them for four. Maybe like a $200 shoe really. But if you like it, you like it, you know? Uh, what size do you have in your olives? Do you have like a 12 and a half women's? I have 13, 13, 11. 11 men's? Do you need 11 men's? Yeah. Then what's the 13 work? Would be like in an 11 and a half? Ah, too big, too big. Preferably 12 and a half. But if anything, I'll probably just double around. Maybe we have to work something out. I was gonna say the last like sneaker events we've been to, you do like one little lap around and then that's the whole thing. Here, you're like doing zigzags in and out. It's 
massive. Absolutely massive. I'm excited to be here. It's gonna be a good day. There's a lot of stuff, a lot of good stuff. Just from doing a little lap around, it seems people are pretty close to market for the prices. So, see how it goes. I'll consent to this. Hello, guys. What's up, man? I was about to get my car towed. We got like an hour before the show really starts, and I'm seeing crud ton of like empty tables. <laughs> there we go. We got my man John holding it down still. Uh, ten and a half. We found one, I can't find no fragment highs though. Yeah, it's looking good. Dude, so many people have already, have already tried negotiating and stuff. And it's like... What pairs? Um, a lot of people are asking about lots, Stussies, flats, and this particular. I'm trying to see what goes so first. Realistically, it probably looks like this might sell first. <laughs> Everyone that's been asking about those, they're like, those are <laughs> these. I think I need these again. Should we wait for this dude? You want to ask him to cash our table out? <laughs> at the size 10? Nine and a half. Maybe the Tiffany too. But... Same, uh, nine and a half as well. Yeah. Cool. Uh, where are you at? Uh, what's your best? I don't know. The size are just kind of big. Yeah. Sheesh. I guess we, I guess to shoot an offer and I, we go from there. Seven. I guess I'll just shoot you my best at nine. Nine. Yeah. I feel like I hunt it off. And then the Tiffany. Let's see, I see what they're at right now. Gosh, it's like thirteen. Was like 13. I'll match highest bid. Trying to match highest bid on him. Probably shoot like eleven fifty. Eleven fifty. If you do 12, I could do that. At least for now. 11.50 and 7.50. Ah, I can't do, I can't do 7.50 on that one. Lowest, like at least lowest right now would probably be nine. They're pretty warm, but it's a shoe you do not see it like that anymore. It's just like right here. Yeah, I feel you. Just need some loving, that's all. Yeah, 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 I'm saying, he catches this table, I'm going home. Oh. What's your best on both? Really, nine flat, probably my best best for these. I was gonna say 19. 19 for, for both? I do cash. I feel like that's really fair. Yeah. I think that sounds pretty good. Yeah. I feel like the Tiffany's like, we're like right there. I'll knock off the, I'll do the 1150 for those. I, these one I gotta be at. I gotta be at nine. That'd be nine fifty, nineteen fifty, really. That's uh, I do nineteen fifty. Let's do it. Boom. Let's go, you. Yes, sir. First deal today. Like I said, called it out. Stussy's gonna be gone, and he picked up some Tiffany's. I took both for nineteen fifty. Uh, worked out on his end. He offered pretty well. Happy to work out the first deal. Keep the ball rolling. Feel free to check them out if needed to. Banger, 19. Appreciate you, man. Appreciate you, bro. Good luck, good luck today. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Cool. We're going to see a lot more of these come in all day. I'm going to go and get a little money count spread. We're going to keep a count of how many times I do this throughout the day. So there goes the first one. <laughs> Okay, let me try, let me try, let me try. <laughs> All right, my turn to do rounds. Honestly, big event. Everyone's still setting up, but um, we're gonna see what we can find. I'm looking for a couple personals, size 11 to 11 and a half, depending on the shoe, so. How you doing, man? Going. Am I allowed to touch yes, you? Okay. 2016, I think, might have been. How much are you asking on Decent condition. A little bit of heel drag, a little bit of star loss, but. You know. So six? Cool, cool. Okay. I'll round about. I mean, condition wise, it's already kind of peeling. Yeah, I feel like it'd be a little far, honestly. I'd probably be at like 350 on a. Four. Can you do four? 460? I'd probably stay at four on those. I'll come around though. You know, you always give me a money, bro. 440. 
You know that's a good price. It is. It's a good price. It is. Clean. Yeah, I'll think about it. I'll oh, think about sure. it. Keep me in mind though. Keep me in mind. Four. I felt like at four, that's pretty much the highest I could go. I feel like any higher, I'd kind of just be selling myself short. Because I would worm, but it's just not for that price. No. <laughs> Dude, I'm telling you, every single one of these is brand new. All of these Travis Lowe's. I need a pre-owned thing. This is a good setup. Nice. Right now the price to beat for some reverse mochas is 1250. If I can find anything under 1250, then maybe. How much for the 13? 725? Are they brand new? Okay. Uh, yeah, that's pretty good. Okay. I'll come back, bro. Definitely come back for those. 12, 13. That's too big. Life is tough in a size 11. <laughs> 10 and a half was easier for some reason. I feel like I could find things. I'm on a search for these, man. Got some shadows too, shadow low. Look at the glitter on that, that's crazy. That's how you know they're real, bro. Yeah, man. You never see DS pairs anymore. Right now, so we got them for eight. So 840, that's pretty good. Uh, shadows, oh damn. Actually up for nine. Hmm, okay. I'll come around, bro. Appreciate it, thank you so much. Damn. What the dunks, man. How are you doing, guys. man? What size are the fours? Um, I have a uh, seven women's, 11 and a half women's, 13 women's, all brand new. And then I have a couple used ones, nine and a half men's, and a nine woman. So mm -hmm. seven and a half, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, what about the reverse mocha? Sorry, keep uh, cutting all good, off. All good, all good. I have pretty much all sizes, but only like two of them are new. Nine and 11 and a half is new. And then I have like eight through 12 brand new, or eight through 12 used. How much are you asking on the used 11? Used 11? Um, probably close to like a thousand. Yeah. Okay. I don't know where it is, right? It's probably in this pile, to be honest. Okay. Um, yeah. I'll, I'll dig it out. I'll loop. Yeah. Circle back. Yeah. I got you, bro. Best prospect so far. I'm probably going to try and uh, drop that. Probably around eight if I can. Uh, we have a couple potential things going on, but as of right now, nothing yet. We'll do another lap when everyone's really settled in, and hopefully, we can find something. So we made it back to the table. We didn't get to capture, but we did get to manage to sell three shoes, some off-white lots. I'm lying, he picked up two off-whites and he picked up Sean Clivers. He came correct, he saw our sticker prices, he understood what we had him priced for. I said, I think all of his offers were fair. Uh, if anything, I offered like 10 bucks or more. Happened real easy, cash us out for 1460. For some reason, at the shop, the lots don't really do too good for us, but when we go to events, man, people dang near pay a lowest ass, and it's just, it works out for us because, you know, market's a little shaky. The ass are always so high, but the bids are so low. I mean, so he came correct. Catch us out. That's another three gone. Size 10. This one market's a little bit higher on. Like a $100 difference. Yeah, stop. You do like 920 on that one. 900 That's like a whole $100 difference. More. Yeah. <laughs> I'll hate it. I'll run it. That's cool, man. That's cool. Let's do it. 11. Another one. Oh, this is some crisp hundreds though. But let's see if I can try it out. Ah. Ah. There it is. Some hidden ones. Yeah. They sold it for nine. Uh, paid eight on it. Don't mind making a hundred on it. And we had like four in stock. So why not get one of them? Get rid of one. We're going to grab them right now. Okay. Cool. He's got them set to the side. Bet. Thank you. And that's what we do, man. Holy ground got motion. They're moving stuff to the side. That's how you know we paid a premium, man. Oh, what's going on? Uh, the 12 and a half women's? Yes. The olives? Can I grab them? Cool, appreciate that. <laughs> These be growing on me so heavily, man. Uh, 900, I got you right here. Eight, nine. Cool, man, thank you, thank you. Just picked up some olives, one of three source pairs that we need to grab. Still on the hunt for the Fragment Travis Scott Highs and John's Reverse Smokers, but we were able to grab these. Uh, Lil Sass was 920. Come on now, I gotta pay good. Gave him 900 for them, so. 2.1? Uh-oh. Looks like we came across the second pair that we need. Were you firm at 2.1? What's your offer on that? Anywhere you can do highest bid? I couldn't. Couldn't do? I probably do. Like nice. Just two hundred dollar difference. $16.50? 17? <laughs> I need it. Something over eighteen. Something over eighteen? I need them. Oh my goodness! I can't pay lowest ask. I mean, it's not lowest ask. You could offer eighteen at my signal. Eighteen? Seventeen fifty. 
do 18.25. <laughs> I'll do 18 flat, promise. That would be my last, real last. Greet to 18, uh, Lois asked, is that 18? But he got the pair I needed. So now we're two down and one more to go. Cool. Appreciate you, G. You already know what it is through the box, man. Locked in the deal for some fragment. Travis Scott, size 11, brand new. I didn't pay what I wanted, but you gotta do what you gotta do to source the pairs out for the people. Last one is this John. Hopefully John can find the size 11 again. Back at the table, made my first sale. It was the Off-White Air Max 90 in a size eight and a half. Kind of a good sale, not gonna lie. We had him up for 650, paid 440. He paid me 620. And he paid basically 10 bucks under StockX lowest ass, so I think it was pretty good. She's been in the shop for day one. You overpaid, that's why. You see the Shrek Crocs? The Shrek? I haven't seen him here yet. Go get him and, and uh, bring him over here so I can lowball you. Um, how much are these? Uh, we have them at 1400 you have to get $200. <laughs> That's a lot of money, though. Cool. Just sold these bad boys right here. Um, we're asking five. We agreed to 470 Not bad. Clean pair. Another pair gone. One, two, three, four. Good business as always. Let me know how it goes. Take a couple blocks. Let me Oh yeah, we've been, we've already sold like like maybe ten already before it even opened. So bro, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. This this section we chose a good spot. This section is the most popping spot in the whole freaking area. Yeah. We have them at six ten, but we're negotiable. Like almost really negotiable. They're at like five thirty. Probably couldn't do sixteen on them though. Oh, I'd probably do like realistically like eighteen. I'd do I'd be like eighteen right now. 17 not bad though, to be honest. Yeah. Run it. Oh, up to you. I have cash. I'd probably, I'd probably be doing it for my 18. Let me see. Let me see what I can do right now. You have cash on you? Uh, huh? Yeah, has, has, uh, everything. Yeah, brand new everything. 670, really lowest, lowest. <laughs> what are, what are you thinking on the coin flip? Six. Oh, I can't. Hey, hey, hey. Six and seven fifty. Six twenty. Yeah, we do, we do a coin flip for it. Let's do it. You have a coin on you? <laughs> Anyone got a quarter? Anyone got a penny? <laughs> a $40 coin flip? He wants it for $620. i will do $660. I'm going to just call it in the air. Whatever it lands on, it wins. Three, two, one. Yeah, that's cool, that's cool, that's cool. We can do that. First L of the day, but you know, we blessed him with uh, 620 for seven and a half brand new. You guys just got here right now? Yeah. Nice, nice, there you go. Knock out the first deal. There you go, I know, I'm owing one right now. 40, 60, 80. Thanks Cool, cool, you two have a good one. There you go. Have fun, have fun. We still love though, it don't even matter. 24%. We still love though, it don't matter. You got uh, we have two size tens. Um, one's pre-owned, one's brand new. 22, 15, and 18. It's actually. Let me know. It's negotiable too. A long time no see. Yes sir. Yes sir. Chilling, man. Good. How's everything, bro? Good. Good. That's all. You know how it goes, man. You just buying today? Keep it. Whatever, man. There's Peep. something I don't have. I mean, you know. Yeah, I'm not saying. What, what shoe are you looking for that you don't already have? I'll take another Cos. Cos, one of my, I wear, I wear my gray ones all the time. I think we sold the Dunkles. We finally sold the Dunkles. Really? Yeah. yeah. I'm glad that a lot of the local uh, companies are coming out. Riff is here. Yeah, uh, yeah. Project Blitz is here. I see it, like Courtside is yeah. over there, yeah. It's good to see everybody. You guys are out here. Yeah, you know, so, no, it's, it's, good good. To see, it's good to see familiar faces. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Bro. Enough money to go around. There's enough money for everybody. That's all I'm saying. Have a good one. I'll come back. Yes, sir. That's fire. That one's tough. I haven't seen these in It's place. tough. How much? We got them at 460. 460? You do a hundred bucks for Travis's and these for those? I can't. I'm just looking to sell today. What? I'm uh, just looking to sell today. No trades. No trades? Yeah. Respect. What did you say? You want to what? He has respect. What's going on? Why are you all the way back? Cause we wanted to be against the wall. Uh, but I mean, it's probably, it doesn't catch like the most foot traffic, to be honest. Where's that? It'll be here tomorrow. Oh, he's not here today? Are you kicking here though? I don't know, bro. It's a little tight back here. I don't know if you can bring any pairs. 
<laughs> you can kick it, but the pair has got to stay. Got to go somewhere else. Hey, you can try it, but I ain't gonna lie. Where the mule? It's a couple little, pairs. I'm not expecting one. It's a little tight back here. A couple pairs is cool. You bring the olives back? I sold them today. Those are mine. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Some people wish on me. They sound like they're trying to say like, yeah. I'm like, dude. That's like brand new. I'm like, bro, I need a boot. Yeah. You just pulled up? Yeah, how's it going for you guys? Chilling. We sold a couple. We've been selling pretty constant, to be honest. We sold a lot, though. Like, yeah. dude bought some Tiffany's. Dude bought some, like, Stussy SB. Sold a pair of shattered backboards. Sold two pairs of lots. That's good, bro. Nice to see you. Easy, bro. I'll see you around. Of course, bro. Set them under here. Well, let's see. Let's see. Tom? If we can find a space to put them, yo, uh, did you uh, get a sale for 850? You just got it. All right, cool. Appreciate you guys. Appreciate it. Another one. Uh, off white bolts. He paid lowest ass, and you know we just can't complain. 850. 850 sale. I mean, let's run it. Nah, we started cooking for real. What's going on? What's going on? It's my buddy Moon Dust right here. This is the crew from What's Holy going Dude on, here. Christian? Absolutely. You guys brought the heat. Looking for a pair? Uh, I was just, you know, I mean, I'm always looking, yeah. but, but I would either do a 7 or a 13. So this is a nice classic right here, dude. Come on. Like, so get this one. I got, I got a crazy right story. This is a beautiful one. I have all of these Ooh. along with these Forbes Hunters. Dang! Um, scent help, the original scent help though, the, the highs, the, the turquoise and the black, right? From so like, the yeah, yeah, yeah. dang! Yeah. But I also have the green pair, right? The green pair, the oh, most expensive yeah, one. I moved from my house, my old house, to my new house, right? So, my one personal pickup for today, so far at least. Uh, size 11, reverse mochas. Uh, market right now is around 12.50. I got them down to 11, so I feel like it was a good deal. They're DS, and I've been looking for this shoe. I couldn't find it anywhere. There was actually a used pair for 11, and I was really thinking about that one, but it's a good thing I found them, so. I'm really happy with these. I'm gonna keep growing the Travis collection, so. And if not, then they're gonna end up at the shop. The more you look at it, the more it's calling your name. <laughs> what y'all talking about? I see this, but what you guys talking about? Uh, what you thinking, man? What you thinking? It's your day today. Oh, uh, I'll show you that. <laughs> what do we have them up for? 550. Size 10. Really, yeah, he has the number in his head. I really don't. So I'm trying to just see. I do five. Knock off 50. I'll make it real simple. I won't even haggle for 520. Right, okay. What did he say? Yeah? Yeah, but he said he literally just got it. Okay. Myself. That's all you, Doug. That's all you, my guy. You gotta squeeze through. Well, I'm gonna just have it. Oh, I got you. <laughs> oh, I got room. You guys been selling it? So like 13, 13 pairs so far. Like real? -ish. They're all expensive pairs, so it's like it adds up crazy. Cool. Just locked it in for 420 on these ones. Uh, he's still looking to work, so I mean. We'll just keep it pushing. Do you have any high stock for these? Uh, feel free to shoot. I'm not gonna lie, I've never had a pair. I'm not even sure what to offer. Uh, let's see. I'll, I'll check market with you. I bet. The 12 are way over like a thousand under lowest ask, and then the 10 and a half. I'm probably matched the highest bid. To be honest. Cool. Let me see what we paid on them. Would you do uh, last sale? 16 for the 12. That's still we'll taking like 15. 15. 15? Oh, yeah. What about these though? Uh, pre owned. 10. I actually have a 10 already, but it's uh, BND as like better condition. Ah, uh, okay. I paid 21. Where do you have for that one? Two. Two. I'll take these and the knock resales for 3500 altogether. I do 15 for the 12. I think we'd be too far off on this one though. Where are you at? Where are we at right now? 27. Really, let's go like 24. Uh, yeah. yeah. Just because it. This is cool though? Yeah, we can do this one. Oh, we, all right? Yeah. Okay, cool. I want the 10 and a half. 
Probably like 15, 50 for the 10 and a half. So the 12, you're at 15? Yeah, I can do 15. I basically, well, I was gonna ask like 15, 25 each, but. Right, I'll take the 12. You wanna do 12 for sure? Let's do that. Or, or, yeah, I'll take the 12, yeah. Say 12 at 15? Yeah. Cool. And so then. Not for resales, locked in. Yeah. Uh, to sell this for 15, size 12. We have another, we have a 10 and a half, but we sold the size 12 for 15. I'm yeah. gonna cash Man, I'm at 2.2. You let me know what you're willing to pay. Uh, I'd be happy to take 2.2. I know. I know. <laughs> cash? Maybe cash. 10 and a half? Yes, OGR, right? Yeah, OGR. Okay, okay. Run it. And the matter sold two, not for resale yellows. I need to grab uh, size 10 pre owned for these ones. 12 sold for what? Uh, 15. And the 10 and a half? Uh, 18, 5. So we're locked in at, uh, what's the total? 420 plus uh, 15. 19. 19, 20. You can do 19 flat for me. I have only hundreds. Well, actually, wait, wait, wait. Yeah. I have a 20 dollar bill too. I got chain, that's all I got. I got chain. Uh, check it. Right. Cool. One, two, three, four. And then we had another one. Just, uh, just enough for me, yeah. right? Yeah. What about that one? Sold for 420. What size is that? Uh, size 10 pre-owned. Because he gave us 19. And then I owe you how much? Uh, 500. Oh wait, 1850. So 50 bucks. I gave you 50 bucks? 50 bucks, yeah. 1850, 50 bucks, not 500, 50 bucks. Yeah. Like five. I was like, appreciate cool. you. Thank you. Appreciate Thank it, you. yes sir, yes sir. There it is, Thank cool. you bro, I appreciate Have you. Have a good one, G. Yes sir, you too. Yes sir. That was a crazy rush. So, uh, yeah, what's up, no, what's going on? Size 10? Uh, 850, but we could work with you. What about the size here? Uh, size like eight and a half, nine. All right, thanks, appreciate it. Man, a little small, little rush. Um, ended up selling two not for resale, the yellow pair. Sold a red pair. I think that's it, but honestly, it was kind of busy, like out of nowhere. Everyone just started coming in. Good thing, everyone offered pretty fair, to be honest. We had them, I ain't gonna lie, we had them a little bit over market, but we worked out a good deal where we ate, they still have enough room for them to sell at whatever cost they want. Happy about it, we got them gone. So, see what else we could get going. They're not for resale, but we sold them for resale. So he could resell them at a reselling event. They're not for resale. You're lucky we started clearing out a little bit. You guys have a vendor pass? Cause I need my wagon, I could get my wagon in my car. We got a wagon right here. It's not as big as mine though, huh? Damn, my bad, cool guy. How much do you have the cost for? What are you thinking on those ones? I don't know. I, I can work with you. I would want to do trades. Uh, I once already yeah. to trade, but it didn't work out. I probably prefer just to do another trade and shop. Today we're just looking to sell them. Yeah, that's fine. I'll, yeah. I'll go to the store. Yep. Hey, does Chris ever go to the other store? The one in Brea? Chris is at Brea right now. Oh, he is? Yeah. yeah I'm, trying to, I'm trying to work a deal with him. Yeah, so we're... we're, we're price. Yeah. <laughs> Look at Chris. Look, Chris think he's happy right now. I know Chris go watch this video and be like... He be lying, bro. Chris be taking people to the paint, man. Look for me, don't look for Chris. I'm the real Chris. Good, good luck trying to find another one of those. Yeah. Six, I'm doing it right now. Six, yeah. run it, that's cool. Right. Add another one to the list. Yeah, cool. Appreciate you, man. Have a good one. We got another one, man. Pay five, sell them for six. How much? Good man, Herman came through with the V loans. He was talking about it when he came to the shop. I thought he was lying. No, he really bought him out, though. I guess we get more fun. Has anyone offered you anything yet? Yeah. I sent another one. Wow. Dang. Incredible. The leather on this is crazy. It's good leather. Today, we're at Supercon LA. I'm here with... Christian from Holy Ground. Holy Ground, fire. Yes, uh -huh. sir. Christian, what is your favorite pair of sneakers that you brought out to SneakerCon today? Oh my. You haven't already sold them. Um, I'll go like two ways. I'll okay. go my personal favorite. You got an A and a B, I like that. Yeah, I'll go my personal favorite. I don't care what anyone says, and then just what I feel is the best. So I'll like start that. off with what the best is. Okay. Can't go wrong. Ch off. Chicago, off-white. 
beautiful bear. Dead stock, 11 and a half. I'm gonna go a little crazy, man. It ain't, oh, the, yeah, yeah. It ain't the season yet. <laughs> but come December, man, you're gonna see me rocking these all the, December. The ghillie suit special. Come on now. You got, crazy. But you the gotta great, leave the them like this. Yeah, yeah you I gotta agree. leave them like this. I agree. So. Yeah, CPFM is, is great. Thank yeah. you. Yeah, they, they, they really kill it, man. If there's one, hold on. A little bonus question. Your turn. Okay. Let me know what you see is your personal favorite yeah. in this collection. So, pairs at the end of the table. Is that a 85 and a 94? Yep. I'm, I'm wearing 85 Chicago's now. They still got life to them. Mahogany's brought me to the table. I'm born in 94 though. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go 94, 94 Chicago. Boom. Check them out. Old, old is your boy. <laughs> yeah. Thanks. We're, we're used to retro Jordans these days, but when those dropped in 94, that was the first of its kind. There you go. Yeah, there. The came back. Really kind of uh, painting the future for how Nike moves today. Everything, and here we are. Is yeah. Re-release classic. It's the perfect sneaker. You yeah. Know, like, there's a reason why we still wear the shoe over 30 years after it was designed. Too iconic. <laughs> Too iconic. Too iconic. Uh -huh. I, I appreciate you. Appreciate you, man. Have a good one. Wait, how much? 750 and 780. What about these ones? Size 8, 10, and 11. 720, 560, and 800. Yeah. Kobe's or what? Yeah, Kobe 6's. Oh, damn, yeah. they're going for that much. Oh, shit. Yeah, these are right here. The Yeezys. What? What's going on, G? 11 and a half and a 9. Brand new, folks. We have like a 9 and a half, 10 and a half, and 11. what we paid to. Listen, yeah. I, listen, I, I'm a Yeah, yeah. Honestly, not a bad offer. It's just, oh. it sucks when we're offering the same thing. I understand. You gotta make money. Yeah. You say you guys will be here tomorrow? Yeah, we'll be here tomorrow for sure. Hey, hopefully tomorrow you want to hold this shit out. The offer what we paid on here. Uh, I told him best 950. Even if we sold it for nine, we would have only made a hundred bucks. She's been sitting for a minute though. Has it really? Low key. We'll be back tomorrow. If anything, it's like nine. It's a hundred bucks more than it's original. Uh, I got two hundred for you right now, man. I got two hundred for you. What the two hundred? Just came back. Just picked up some heat. What y'all know about the Chicago lows, man? Big swoosh gang only lows. Got them for a fat steal. Bought them for twenty bucks. You know I should give them away. Twenty bucks. So. I kind of made an impulse purchase. It was towards the end of the event. The guy was asking six in the in the beginning of the event. I got him down to 440. I didn't really want to pay that. I kind of waited. He's pretty much empty now, and he kind of just wanted to get rid of these. So I paid four. They're a little cooked, to be honest. As you can see, a little cooked. You know, a little bit of heel drag and stuff. But OG all, they're clean otherwise. And I'm gonna just use them as beaters, to be honest. I mean, other pairs that look like these, they go for like six, eight hundred. So for four hundred, I can't really beat it. Pretty happy about this. My entire collection Jordan One lows now. So. You got uh, Andrew go tax you. Andrew will not tax. How much you want bet? If you offer real fair, I might just say yes. I won't even negotiate. Yeah, that's true. I can't do it right. Now. It's not smart. It's not smart. I'll do 25. I'll do 2150. Ah. 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 I'll go. Yeah. Like, maybe like 24 lowest. Actually, I have a nine and a half already, so I buy this one. Are these all GS? Let me see. The one with the trash? Yeah. Hey, yo, David, can I get a pick, bro? That's cool. Hey, yo, hey, come take a picture. Take a picture, Peter, real quick. My fault. Can I get a pick, too? Shoot, sure, easy. Hey bro, they ducky. I don't care what nobody say. They ducky you. Yeah, appreciate they ducky it, you. Let's go. Appreciate it, G. Oh, that one. <laughs> What's up, man? Oh, Devin Haney, uh, professional boxer, undefeated. Oh, you undefeated lightweight. You moving up, regardless whatever you're moving up to. They boxing had too many weight classes. He got a lot of buzz, man. A lot of people been ducking him. A little agendas, people saying that he's ducking them, but regardless, undefeated. Probably the best boxer out right now. Gotta get a pick, bro. He got drip too. 
I was actually fired that we got to see him. They, were, they had like no post of him coming through. Uh, Austin Reeves, I don't really care about him like that. I got to pick with him, so I'm happy. <laughs> sleep we got a lot of foot traffic I had a lot of interest in shoes not too many people were really pulling the trigger on shoes and if they were trying to they were like honestly lowballing but shout out to the people who did pay good who didn't really hassle too much I appreciate those type of people because they understand what the market is man and they understand they can still get this amount without being greedy so I was happy to help them out I'm assuming maybe people are probably just looking to buy tomorrow for the Saria for what they sold on Saturday so yeah We'll tune in tomorrow, man, see what happens. SneakerCon day one. I feel like, just as Christian said, we got a lot of foot traffic, we got a lot of interest. I guess what really kind of maybe held us back is the sizing on some of our stuff. Although we had what people were looking for, it just wasn't in their sizes. And that's not anyone's fault. When it did happen that it was their size, we were able to make a deal pretty quick. So I think we sold a good amount. And I think that we'll sell a decent amount tomorrow too. Hopefully it's just as packed. Yeah, I think we sold good. All right, y'all, day one. <laughs> I blinked. <laughs> Been up since, I'm gonna say like three in the morning. Exhausted, but you know what? It's an experience. My first sneaker con, at least like vending and stuff uh, rather than attending. We did pretty good. We sold somewhere around like 13 pairs, 14 pairs, which is pretty good because we all we only had heat today. I had a good time with everybody, met up with some friends, with some homies, caught up with everybody, saw some familiar faces. If we saw you and you guys said, what's up? We appreciate you guys. You guys mean everything to us. Still got day two tomorrow. It's gonna be a different crew tomorrow. Christian will still be here, but uh, me and John are gonna exit out of here and uh, good luck to everybody tomorrow and you'll see the second part of it. Cool, man, that just wraps it up. Finally got all the pairs back into the car. Excited for day two tomorrow. Don't know what's gonna be planned, but I'm hoping it's gonna be a banger. Y'all stay tuned, man. Stay holy, stay blessed, and catch you tomorrow.